We will continue our look aways, our look team look aheads in our previews with Hoax Bluff, the Eagles coming off a seven win season. However, most noticeably with this program, they say goodbye to a history making group of seniors. That class included four year starter running back Darian Meads, who rushed for over 6,000 career yards and over 65 touchdowns. He was named an all state selection multiple times. The Eagles also quarterback. Ashton Gullich, he led the offense to over 30 points per game on offense over the last three years. However, Coach Mike Robertson says the guys that they left behind have great lessons in leadership for this returning group. We did lose some really good players, but you know, if you have good teams, you're going to always lose good players. That's, that's a sign that you've had good senior leadership. But I'm excited about our guys. We've got 63 guys. Uh, they've uh, showed up for workouts from day one. We came back. I don't know if they were bored at home or, or were so easy. They just couldn't wait to get back and talk to somebody they knew, you know, or whatever. But they've had great attendance this summer. Actually, the best attendance we've ever had in summer workouts. Meanwhile, the Eagles offseason also included a change in classification. Host Bluff moving from 4A down to 3A. The level of competition, though, does not drop at all. The Eagles share Region 5 along the likes of state champion Piedmont, state semifinalist Welburn, and perennial powers Saxon Ohatchee. I feel no different than I did in 4A. You know, I remember we went 4A. Uh, I remember where I was standing when they told us it was going 4A. And it wasn't going 4A. It was who you're playing in your region. Same thing here in 3A. But there's, you know, good football team. Some of these 3A teams, I want to remind you guys, we're beating teams in my region in 4A. So, you know, so I see really no change. It's just going to be every week. You better be ready to play or you're not going to you're not going to win. The Eagles will begin their season at Southside. That game is coming up on Thursday, August the 27th.